meteorologist Ethan Houston. Average highs for this time of the year are in the 40s. But it is cold out there. And look at Hershey from Dauphin County early this morning. Much of the Susquehanna Valley was below zero. Looks like we tied the record for the coldest morning for this date in Harrisburg with a low of zero. Well, unfortunately, I expect the cold to be sticking around for much of the week ahead. Not record breaking cold, but a slight improvement, but still well below seasonal averages. Snow will move in later this evening after the evening rush hour and become more intense as we head through the overnight hours and start to accumulate, and it could impact the morning rush hour tomorrow. More details on that in just a minute. Winter weather advisory will go into effect at 7 o'clock and continue to stay into effect till early tomorrow morning. We do have winter storm warnings to our south of the Mason Dixon line, where heavier snow is expected toward Baltimore and Washington, D.C. Live look outside right now over Lancaster. Temperatures are slowly warming up. We're climbing from where we were below zero in Lancaster County to now a warm eight degrees for this time of the year. Nine below is what it feels like outside with the winds out of the northwest at 15. Clouds are staying fairly thick. That's ahead of the moisture that's uh, bringing down some light snow showers back over West Virginia. The air that's sitting overhead is very, very dry. So here on the radar, you can see the leading edge of the snow trying to approach the Mason-Dixon line. May take it a little longer than models are predicting. Anywhere from about 8 to 10 o'clock is when we'll start to see the light snow showers fall. The center of the storm is well to our south. Right now, back over uh, the mid-Mississippi River Valley. So for today, mostly cloudy skies, cold highs only making it to the low to mid teens. And then after dark, some light snow will start to creep in from the southwest and become widespread overnight. The snow will be heaviest closer toward the Mason Dixon line. Temperatures aren't dropping much. We're only going to go down to about 8 to 12 degrees overnight tonight. It is going to be a powdery, a light, and slick snow. So whatever falls is going to stick on the ground. Snow showers will start tapering off around 8 o'clock in the morning. Could see some breaks in the clouds and won't be as cold tomorrow. Still below seasonal averages, but it'll be better with highs in the mid 20s to near 30 degrees. Here were the lows this morning two below in Lancaster. We tied the record of zero in Harrisburg. It was 11 below in Lewistown this morning, four below in Sealands Grove. We have improved. We're now above, free, or above zero currently in Lewistown. It's nine in Harrisburg and currently 10 in Gettysburg. Notice still very cold off to our west. And also to the south, it's only 20 right now, one of the warmer spots in the region uh, down in Richmond. So the clouds have increased from west to east. There's that leading edge of the snow showers that will be slowly moving in as we head through the evening drive. There's a ridge of high pressure that's still sitting off to our north that's keeping that drier air in place, but this is going to win out. Eventually, this storm system is going to work its way through the Tennessee River Valley and towards Virginia and North Carolina as we head through tonight and tomorrow morning. So here's a breakdown of what we're expecting. Here's the predictor taking you through the afternoon hours. Clouds will stay fairly thick. By 7 o'clock, some light snow showers will start to be moving into Franklin County, Cumberland County, and Adams County. This will become light and fairly widespread as we head through the midnight hour and then continue on in through the morning drive. Notice the heaviest snow is off to our south and southeast and over toward the Jersey Shore. By 8 to 10 o'clock, the snow showers will be out of here. We'll actually start to see some clearing in the skies late in the afternoon. Then comes another cold front on into Wednesday. This could throw us some snow showers, possibly even some squalls of snow during the afternoon on Wednesday. And then temperatures will go back down behind this front as it moves on. Through. So 7 to 10 o'clock, the snow will arrive west to east. It will become more widespread after 10, I'm saying closer to midnight through tomorrow morning at 6 o'clock. So this will have a big impact to the travel early tomorrow morning. And then snow will quickly end from west to east. Coding to two inches, mainly north of Harrisburg, much of the Susquehanna Valley, Harrisburg, Gettysburg, York, Lancaster, two to five, looking toward the lower end of this right now, and then possibly some heavier totals south of the Mason Dixon line. Only a high of 14 today, 20s for tomorrow and on into our Wednesday, teens again for Thursday and Friday. Oh boy, we're really getting it too. Yeah. <laughs> All right, thanks, Ethan.